Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video. Today we are talking about the best applications for Zettel Custom and it is great to have a system for your knowledge management like the Zettel Custom system but some apps do better with a system than others and in today's video we are going to take a look at the apps that are in my opinion the best for Zettel Custom system and there are mainly two things I like to have in an application for Zettel Custom. The first is backlinking, uh, which a lot of uh, apps have with double square brackets and you can link to a new page. That is the first thing, but I also do enjoy having a beautiful graph view uh, to get an overview of all of my different uh, notes. That is something you don't have in the uh, original Zettel Custom because the original Zettel Custom is done in a Zettel or a slip box. Uh, but with these applications, you can actually easier find the different notes you have put inside of there. So the first one is LogSec and it has both of the things. It has both the graph view as well as the um, backlinking and it has a lot of other features as well. It has whiteboards, it has a plugin system, you can have your tasks inside of here, you can add tags to your um, to your different notes and it is basically an outliner so you can take outlined notes uh, inside of uh, this application so um, basically bullet point notes uh, and you can just continue to write inside of uh, your bullet points you can jump into your bullet points as well you can nest things beneath those bullet points I could keep I could have infinite nesting with this actually so I could nest even more let's now jump back to the first page you can see that things are nested underneath each other so you have the ability to nest things this is great if you like to take really short notes which is good for the Zettel custom system so your notes in the Zettel custom system should be by bite sized and that is why um an application like LogSec might be great. You also have uh, flashcards and whiteboards inside of here. So if you like to see things more visually, you can do that. If you are a student and you like to use flashcards, you can do that as well. So that is the first application and it is LogSec. The second application we have is actually Obsidian. And similarly to uh, LogSec, it has uh, it is local first, so all of your notes are saved locally on your device. These two applications are best if privacy is a huge concern. And just like LogSec, you have a plug-in system which makes this application really, really versatile. It can become whatever you want it to become, but it is also great for a Zettel custom system with a really cool graph view uh, and you have the ability to actually link different things together as well so you can do double square brackets and I can link different things together right here like this uh, so you have backlinking you have the graph view you even have whiteboards inside of here as well you have daily notes uh, whiteboards are actually called canvas inside of obsidian and you have the plugin system which allows you to have things like databases and everything else you would want inside of an application it is super versatile and it is great for the settled custom system the only thing that might become a minor problem is if you take notes that are way too long because uh, Settle Custom wants you, as I said, to have bite-sized notes. So instead of having this as one note, I would probably have each of the summaries as a single note inside of my Zettel custom system. I personally do not use a Zettel custom system and that's why it looks a little like this. I haven't optimized for the system simply because I do not use it. But as I said, a great application Obsidian is probably one of, if not the best note taking app on the market. Uh, and it is great if you value your privacy and you want to own your own notes as well. Both of these applications, both 
Obsidian and Logsec can be used for free. They have paid plans for syncing if you want to sync between devices, but there are ways to sync without paying for their uh, sync module. You can actually sync through things like Dropbox or uh, things like uh, iCloud Drive. I have tested OneDrive, didn't work properly, but OneDrive on an iPhone is terrible. So uh, Google Drive, uh, iCloud Drive, iCloud Drive actually works real good. So you can use uh, third party syncs to uh, sync instead of paying for their syncing uh, protocol. The next application we have on the list is actually AnyType. AnyType is an application I've talked about before. Uh, the thing with AnyType is that it is in a really early stage, so uh, things might change uh, quite quickly. So the last time, I think it was a couple of weeks ago, I filmed a YouTube video about AnyType. It didn't look like this. Now we actually have our spaces on the left side here. Uh, we actually had that here uh, before. But uh, what I like about AnyType, except the fact that just like Obsidian and Logsec, uh, you get all of your files stored locally. Um, and it is open source as well. Uh, but what I really like about this application is that if you jump into um, your databases, so a lot of applications offer databases like this, but what uh, what AnyType offers that makes it great for a Zettel custom system is that your databases can actually be turned to singular graphs. So I can have a graph within my database, which is amazing because this means that I can both have a Zettel custom system inside of my note-taking app, but I can also use it for uh, to-dos and uh, project management without cluttering up my, um, without it cluttering up my graph view like it might do here, because this is the global graph. So here I have things like tasks, uh, which isn't something you would put in your Zettel custom system. But if I now jump back into my uh, resources database, you can actually see that I can look at only the database as a graph view. This is what makes uh, AnyType one of my personal favorites because you can use it as an all-in-one solution. The problem with AnyType or the minus with AnyType is that it is in a really early stage. So still a few bugs. Sometimes the app doesn't work properly. Uh, and it still needs a little bit uh, of more time to develop to the level of many of the other uh, applications we have on this list and in general in the note-taking space. We also have Reflect App, which is one of the easiest to use uh, backlinked note-taking apps. I used this, I think it was two years ago. It has gotten a lot better and it was really good back then. But you have things like daily notes. You have the ability to take notes here. You have the ability to link your different notes together and you have a beautiful looking graph view. This is a really fast application, best for those who have an iOS uh, device when it comes to your phone because they don't have an Android application. You can use the web version on your Android uh, device, but it isn't as good as having a dedicated application, but you have the ability to quickly take notes. They have a whisper integration, so OpenAI's whisper where you can talk out your notes uh, and you have this uh, view right here, which allows you to see all of your different notes connected together. Pricing wise, this is a bit of an expensive application. It will cost you $10 each month billed yearly. So no monthly plan here, only the yearly plan. So it is a bit of um, investment. But uh, the application is really good. They have done an amazing job developing it. You have the ability to chat to your notes as well. And just in general, everything they do seems to be uh, great and they're exactly the right thing. But this is also good 
for the Zettle custom system because you have the ability to link things together. One minus again here, just like in Obsidian, is the fact that you can end up taking um, longer notes, which isn't necessarily the best for the Zettle custom system. You want bite-sized uh, notes, and that is why uh, this application might not necessarily be the best for for a Zettel custom system, but it can be uh, if you tweak it a little bit. For example, if you use bullet notes uh, inside of the different pages you have. Another application that deserves to be here is actually uh, Super Notes. The way Super Notes works is that you have these cards right here and you can write things in your cards uh, and you can link them together like this. So just to show you how the linking works. Uh, and what's amazing about these cards right here is that they uh, have a soft limit on them. So if I just jump into this right here and open this up, you can see that this is a huge note, probably way too long for the Zettel custom system. Um, but once I press enter, you can see that this is 4,309 characters over the soft limit. So they have a soft limit, which is a great way to remind you to take shorter, more bite-sized notes. Uh, and you also have a graph view inside of here, so I can change it to see it as a graph. And I can see the graph in 2D, or I can see it in 3D to allow me to see how my notes are connected together. Again, this is one of the easy to use uh, applications out of the box uh, and just start writing inside of that, inside of it. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I like it. It is uh, really fast. It has an offline version if you use it on your phone uh, and want to be able to have your notes accessible while you're running around it can actually do that as well uh, this is probably one of my favorites for an easy to use zettel custom system great for collaborative note taking as well was mainly uh, actually made for students but it has become uh, popular among pkmers as well so another great choice for your Zettel custom system. So we have two more applications. The next one is actually um, Workflowy and Workflowy is a cheap application, also an outliner close to or similar to um, LogSec. But uh, the way uh, this works is that it doesn't have a graph view, but it has backlinking, it has tagging. Here you can see that things are backlinked. You can see your backlinks uh, when you are on a page or inside of a bullet. Uh, but what I uh, like about this application is that it has something called mirror things. Uh, so it can mirror your bullet points. Imagine a folder where a synced version of the file lives inside of two or even three different folders. That is how mirror bullets works inside of a workflow. So, uh, these are actually mirrored. You can see it by the shape of the bullet. Uh, when it is in a diamond shape, it means that it is uh, actually mirrored. Uh, and these live in multiple different spaces. So for my clothing brand's website, it actually uh, lives here inside of projects because it is a project, but it also lives inside of the clothing brand itself. Uh, and these are, in my case, mainly things I use for organizing or I have tested out for organizing things. But this can actually be great in a Zettel custom system as well to have things live in multiple different folders or places uh, depending on what you write and how you would like to set up your Zettel custom system. But Workflowy is an application that is really easy to learn compared to a lot of the other uh, applications I have shown you. So AnyType, LogSec and Obsidian, all of them has have a bit of a learning curve to them. While uh, Workflowy is a lot easier to learn uh, out of the box and to use out of the box. Uh, and 
it is great for Zettel Custom because you have the ability to link different things together. This is also an application that works great uh, for um, uh, works great for general life organization if that is something you would like to do inside of an application uh, in addition to having your knowledge inside of there. It doesn't have a global graph uh, so you would probably need to do a bit more work and be more precise with your linking since you can't see everything in in an overview so organization uh, in my opinion would be a little bit more important in an application like this but a great choice if you want an easy to use application for your Zettel custom system. Last application not necessarily just an application for a Zettel custom system this can actually be used for many things this app is called Tana and Tana just like Workflowy and Logsec is an outliner as you can see I uh, prefer outliners for a Zell custom system to make things more bite-sized but we can uh, easily capture things you have the ability to see things in a more structured format like databases uh, as you can see right here uh, with the ability of uh, super tags but you also can link different things together as you see I have done right here again we don't have a global graph uh, which I would preferly have um, which I would prefer to have inside of my uh, Zettel custom application but uh, it is still um, a good application to use for Zyl Custom. It is a bit uh, harder or actually a lot harder to learn than something like Workflowy has a learning curve to it but once you get the hold of an application like this uh, you will probably fall in love with it. A lot of people have uh, done exactly that. They've learned the application and fallen in love with it. It is not only good for a Zettel custom system which is basically the ability to link things together. That is what it has. It is also good for general life management and they are doing some amazing things with AI if that is something that is important to you um, in addition to having a Zettel custom system. But all of these applications are great for a Zettel custom system. You can actually have it inside of almost every single application with backlinking. Anyways, thank you so, so much for watching today's video. Comment down below if you have any questions and I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you so, so much for watching today's video.